Michigan Whitecaps are preparing for their 27th annual Step Up to the Plate fundraiser happening this week. And joining us to talk more about it is Community Relations Manager Jenny Garoni. Jenny, good to see you. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so first of all, just tell us a little bit about this fundraiser if people haven't heard of it before. We've been doing this fundraiser, this is the 27th year, and the purpose of it is to raise money for the Ted Raspberry Youth League, which formerly was known as the Inner City Youth Baseball and Softball Program. So the funds raised support that, they buy the kids uniforms, gloves, all the equipment, um, and it's a program that kids can participate all summer long. So this is a great thing because obviously there's some areas where kids that, you know, don't have the opportunities to do those kind of things and play baseball. So what are some of the things that people can purchase or some of the things that are on auction that they think be a part of? Yeah, so most of our auction items went live today. We have a ton of sports memorabilia, a lot of autographed baseballs, um, a Matthew Stafford Detroit Lions football, which I'm guessing might be a little bit more valuable now. Um, and even if you're not a sports fan, you know, if you're not into the autographed jerseys or the game used crack bats, we've got a lot of family packages. Um, a ton of local companies have participated in this with donations. The Grand Rapids Art Museum, Celebration Cinema, um, AJ's Family Fun Center. We've got a lot of experiences too. I know people have been kind of cooped up. They want um, they want excitement. They want trips and hotel stays. We've got a ton of that. Um, and companies have been really great working with expiration dates. So, you know, even if we don't know when all of this will end, um, your what you purchase is going to be good for a while. Absolutely. And we're also hearing that people at home might have the opportunity to vote on some YMCA youth art. Yes, this is really cool. We've never done this before, but we had some of the YMCA kids create artwork about what the community means to them. So on the site, if you go to wcf2021.givesmart.com, that's where you'll find the auction. You'll also find this voting section where for $3, you can place a vote on your favorite piece of artwork. The winning artwork, the student will win um, a Whitecaps experience. All the kids will get to come to a Whitecaps game, but the winner will get something a little bit extra. Jenny, I want to ask, uh, you know, especially because of the last year and what we've all gone through, how are things going with the Whitecaps? Is there some uh, excitement building as maybe the season might draw near? There's definitely excitement. We're feeling very optimistic. We don't have a schedule yet, but we're hopeful we're going to have that within the next few weeks or so. Don't quote me on that, but hopefully soon. And we can't wait to have everybody back at Fifth Third Ballpark.